Okay, I'm just getting ready for a, another overnight adventure and we're going to Lake Yurunga, Talawa Dam at uh, Kangaroo Valley. And this will be the first trip that uh, I get to take with Noi. So she's always been very gun shy about, uh, she's been out in the kayak with me before, but never overnight. And um, we finally managed to talk her into an overnight trip. So it should be lots of fun, hopefully. Hopefully it goes well and we don't get rained on. But uh, yeah, we'll be breaking out the, uh, the second seat so that we can make our .65 kayak, which is wrapped up over here, into a double. And um, yeah, we'll be leaving in about a day's time. So I'm just going back through all the gear and making sure that uh, our first aid kit's complete and all the other stuff is, is there because there's nothing worse than getting uh, away and finding out you're missing something crucial. <laughs> this is all the food for tomorrow's trip. We've got five litres of water and noise more organised than me. We've got stuff in nice containers and um, some toilet paper and the obligatory bottle of yellowtail. You want me to send it? Yes, please. I have also loaded up the uh, car. <laughs> so, what I have managed to do is get the second half of the kayak inside with all the gear. So it's going to be cramped, but uh, at least I don't have to load it all on the roof. Yes. Okay, it's uh, four thirty in the morning and we managed to get up early because um, Steve went rowing this morning. Otherwise, we probably would have done what we normally do, which is sleep in. And just been charging up some of the stuff I'm thinking I'm going to take with me. Um, and I would have loved to have taken the uh, the drone with me, but unfortunately, um, we have issue with the uh, with the um, battery and the charger. So, but we will be taking the action cam so we can get some shots in the water. I'm not going to shoot too much uh, footage, but uh, I won't take the charger cable with me because I've only got one. I'm probably charging like $300. Well, that's a bit of an exaggeration, but they overcharge for all the accessories, so I'm not going to risk wrecking the cable. And we have our power bank on charge, so hopefully that's uh, charged up nicely. We will take that for charging the phone. And, um,. Our, uh, Bluetooth speaker. <laughs> no, he's just erasing the 352 photos that I took accidentally. Don't spill us over. Lake Yurunga, the beautiful Talawa Dam. Nice and green on this side, but unfortunately on this side, the ravages of the last bushfires this time last year. And that beautiful sound of cicadas in the distance. Hello. Oh, Little waterfall on the burnt out ridge. And up there is the, it looks like a face from Minecraft. Man rock. Hope it stopped shaking. 
I'm going to try and zoom in. How's that for supreme cinematography? Not. Big goanna. Big fella. You're going to be trying to come and steal dinner later. No is using enough um, air regard to kill all the local insects. If you sprayed every part of the tent, we're probably going to die in our sleep tonight from asphyxiation. And this is our Siam hammock setup. And we're sleeping like all married couples, nice and close together. And this is the spot. And it's the same spot I stayed at last time, but for some reason I couldn't recognize it. So we went about five kilometers further up the river before we realized that no, this was actually the spot. Um, and we've already run into our good friend, the Goanna, that you saw earlier, so hopefully he won't come around and get some dinner. Again. The air goes in here. I thought you just swing, swing, swing. Something very satisfying about an open fire. Especially when you've had uh, problems finding dry wood. Anyway, I think it's a way. Right, George, what's the dinner? <laughs> this is our dinner. <laughs> That's right. We rescued a lot of these guys from the water. Alas, it's too late for him. We just finished eating various really horrible stuff out of cans. That's good. And this is our fire and the princess has her throne. And this is our magnificent view. Action. Where are you? Can you see? Hello. Is it comfortable? Yeah. Like a sleep in the hammock. <laughs> it's good. These knots are okay? Yeah, they're good. You take a picture? Checking the knots. Yep, okay, I haven't got enough life insurance, so. And. As predicted, afternoon. I think we're going to get wet. Are you scared? Mm. I don't like I'm thunder. scared, mommy. I don't like thunder. I don't like lightning. Even if the carters are scared, they get quiet every time there's a burst of thunder. 
The cicada alarm clock has started. Princess Noi. Princess Noi. Did you sleep well? Sorry. The princess needs to sleep. Coffee is on its way. All happening on my fuel stove that I made out of an old Audi cat food can. This is also another fuel stove that I made out of an old drink can that works very, very well as well. We've got um, instructions on the internet on how to do this, but the Yaldi one is just um, a cat food can with holes cut in the side, so very simple to make. And as you can see, it does the job. Boy, what is boiling? Coffee is go. Goodbye, Lake Yuranga. Bye. Princess got in without getting her feet wet. Waterfall! How wide is this? And this is where our friendly little waterfall comes out. And we have to be really careful here because. On the way here we jumped about three or four trees. We got logs stuck on one when we were going full tilt. I thought we might have even nearly put a hole in the boat, but uh, thank God for roto molded plastic. Very difficult over the shoulder shot of the caution spillway. I think it says 500 meters. Can't really read it because it's got stuff growing in front of it. And there is the dam over there. So we're very nearly home. Uh, uh, I'm dying. The mighty Talawa Dam in overflow.